their Hayabusa 2 mission in the extended mission, it just so happens is going to a dark comet. Cool. So in 2031, we're going to have... That'll blow it open. Yeah. It <laughs> might, well, it's at least going to rendezvous with it, but we'll have enough sensitivity to measure things like outgassing or dust if it's there. Literally, comets are dark, even when you, they don't satisfy your definition. Right. Right. <laughs> we think of them as these white things moving through space, but... Their material is very dirty. Discuss the possibility that the water, that dark comets could have brought water to the Earth. So. More so than other comets? Mm -hmm. Well, there's so people used to think that comets delivered water to the Earth, and we still don't know where the Earth's oceans came from. Imagine a rock flying through space, traveling at unimaginable speeds, seemingly on a mission. But unlike other celestial bodies, this one isn't leaving behind a tail of dust or gas that we can easily spot. In fact, it's accelerating, much like a comet, but without the classic signs. It's like the space equivalent of a chameleon, acting like a comet, but looking like an asteroid. What are we dealing with here? A strange hybrid object that defies our understanding of comets and asteroids. These are the dark comets. So what exactly are dark comets, and why are they so important to both our understanding of space and the protection of our planet? Today, we're going to explore the mystery of these elusive objects, discuss what makes them different from regular asteroids or comets, and understand their potential implications for the future. And if you think this is just another scientific anomaly that can be ignored, think again. Dark comets might just be the key to understanding the origins of water on Earth and even life itself. Dark comets are a relatively new discovery in the field of astronomy, and they pose one of the most intriguing mysteries in our solar system. To understand dark comets, it's crucial to first understand how comets generally behave. When comets approach the sun, they heat up, and their icy cores start to sublimate, turning from solid to gas, which causes the characteristic glowing tails that we all recognize. But here's the twist. Dark comets don't seem to have the classic tail or coma, yet they still exhibit comet-like behavior. They accelerate as if they are ejecting gas, which is the hallmark of cometary activity. So what gives? These dark comets are objects that defy traditional definitions. While we typically categorize celestial bodies into clear boxes, asteroids or comets, dark comets seem to occupy a middle ground. They behave like comets, accelerating due to some form of outgassing, but they lack the visible tail. These objects represent a whole new class of small solar system bodies, forcing scientists to reconsider the boundaries of these categories. While typical comets are easily recognizable by their tails and their explosive behavior, dark comets occupy a more mysterious middle ground. They defy categorization and challenge our traditional understanding of space objects. Unlike typical comets, dark comets don't leave behind visible tails, yet they exhibit similar behaviors like acceleration caused by outgassing. These objects force us to reconsider the boundaries of what we know about the small bodies in our solar system. So, what makes dark comets so different from other asteroids or comets? Simply put, dark comets blur the lines between these two types of space objects. They are asteroids in the sense that they don't leave behind a visible tail or coma, but they behave like comets because they accelerate due to outgassing. So far, scientists have identified a few of these mysterious objects, and they are challenging our current models of how these space bodies work. The real question, though, is, what exactly is causing this acceleration? While traditional comets release gases like water vapor or carbon dioxide to generate acceleration, dark comets seem to do so in a way that isn't immediately visible. Scientists believe they may be emitting gases that are harder to detect, such as water vapor or other volatiles. These gases may sublimate directly into space without forming the typical bright tail we associate with comets. The lack of a visible coma doesn't mean these objects aren't accelerating. They're simply doing so in a less obvious way. This type of sublimation might be happening at a much lower rate than what we're used to seeing in traditional comets, which makes the acceleration more subtle. Still, the effects are real, and we can see them in the motion of these objects. Why does this matter? Understanding what makes dark comets behave the way they do 
could lead to groundbreaking insights into the origins of water and organic materials on Earth. If these objects are indeed releasing water as they travel through the solar system, they could be part of the puzzle of how water, one of the key ingredients for life, ended up on our planet. The Mystery of Non-Gravitational Acceleration Now let's dive into the heart of the mystery, non-gravitational acceleration. This is the phenomenon that causes dark comets to behave like comets despite not having the typical cometary tail. In simple terms, Non-gravitational acceleration happens when an object in space experiences forces other than gravity that cause it to move faster or change direction. For typical comets, this acceleration is caused by outgassing, the release of gases as they approach the sun. This process is pretty easy to spot because the gas and dust form a bright, visible tail. But with dark comets, we don't see that tail. So why are they accelerating? Scientists speculate that the outgassing could still be occurring, but in a way that's not immediately visible to us. The absence of dust could mean that the gases are sublimating directly into space without creating the characteristic coma. Another possible explanation is that these dark comets may release materials that don't leave visible traces, like water vapor or other less detectable compounds. This brings us to a key comparison Oumuamua. This object also displayed strange acceleration, and its motion couldn't be explained by gravity alone. Some scientists hypothesized that Oumuamua could be a probe from an alien civilization due to its bizarre behavior, but this was quickly debunked. It turns out that Oumuamua was likely just a very strange object, a comet or asteroid behaving unpredictably as it passed through our solar system. Dark comets exhibit similar behaviors, and understanding them better could reveal just how common these mysterious accelerations are in our solar system. Contextualizing Dark Comets in the Solar System Dark comets are found in a variety of locations throughout the solar system. Some of them originate in the outer solar system, while others are more common closer to Earth. The larger outer dark comets tend to have eccentric orbits which means they move in elongated paths, sometimes reaching far away from the sun and other times coming closer. While larger, more distant dark comets have eccentric orbits that are less likely to intersect with Earth's path, smaller dark comets with near circular orbits may come closer to our planet. These objects are more likely to cause interactions with Earth, making them a focal point for ongoing monitoring and study. These objects could potentially collide with Earth, although their small size and the unpredictability of their orbits mean that such impacts are relatively rare. But given that dark comets exhibit comet-like behavior, we may one day see a scenario in which one of these objects does indeed cause significant damage. This is why scientists are paying closer attention to them. Importance of Studying Dark Comets the study of dark comets isn't just about curiosity. It could have significant implications for the future. For one, these objects might hold clues about the origins of water and life on Earth. Comets have long been thought to be a potential delivery system for water and organic compounds to early Earth, and dark comets may have played a similar role. If dark comets release water vapor or other volatile compounds as they travel, they could be part of the same process that helped to seed Earth with the ingredients necessary for life to form. But there's also a more immediate reason why we need to study these objects. Planetary defense. While the risk of a catastrophic collision with Earth is low, the unpredictable nature of dark comets means that we need to track their movements closely. These objects could potentially collide with Earth, causing significant damage or even triggering a Chelyabinsk type event. The 2013 meteor explosion over Russia that caused widespread damage despite the meteor being relatively small. Understanding and tracking dark comets could help us prepare for any potential future collisions. A deeper dive into the acceleration mystery. The mystery of dark comets lies in their seemingly paradoxical behavior. They accelerate like comets but without the visible outgassing that we normally associate with cometary tails. To understand this, we need to look at the mechanics of non-gravitational acceleration. In traditional comets, 
The acceleration is a result of outgassing. When the comet's icy nucleus is heated by the sun, it releases gases like water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane. These gases create a force that pushes the comet away, causing it to speed up. The force is visible in the form of a tail as the gas and dust trail behind the nucleus. But with dark comets, we don't see this tail. What gives? Scientists believe that dark comets might still be releasing gases, but in a way that's not visible with current observational methods. One possibility is that these comets release gases like water vapor or carbon monoxide, but without the surrounding dust particles that typically form a visible tail. This form of outgassing is subtle, but it still generates the non-gravitational acceleration that we observe. Think of dark comets as the silent movers of space. While typical comets create noticeable tails due to their outgassing, dark comets accelerate without leaving a trail. This subtle acceleration happens due to outgassing, but the gases involved aren't visible with our current technology. This quiet propulsion keeps dark comets elusive, which is why they've only recently become a focus of study. The two populations of dark comets. Dark comets aren't all the same. In fact, scientists have identified two distinct populations of dark comets, larger, eccentric ones that orbit farther out in the solar system, and smaller, inner ones with nearly circular orbits that bring them closer to Earth. These two populations differ in their behaviors, and understanding their characteristics is key to grasping the broader mystery of dark comets. The larger, eccentric dark comets typically have orbits that take them far from the Sun, sometimes approaching the outer regions of the solar system. These objects are less likely to impact Earth, but they play a crucial role in our understanding of the solar system's evolution. Their orbits are more unpredictable, and studying them can reveal information about the formation and migration of planetary bodies. On the other hand, the smaller, inner dark comets have orbits that bring them closer to Earth. These objects are more likely to interact with Earth or other planets, potentially posing a risk to our planet. Their behavior, especially their unpredictable acceleration, makes them harder to track, which is why studying them is crucial for planetary defense. Real-world example. The Chelyabinsk meteor serves as a reminder of how even small space objects can cause significant damage. In 2013, a meteor exploded over Russia, injuring over 1,500 people and causing extensive property damage. While the Chelyabinsk meteor was much smaller than the objects we usually associate with catastrophic impacts, it highlighted the importance of tracking small objects that might be harder to detect. Dark comets, especially those with smaller inner orbits, pose a similar challenge. While they may not always be large enough to destroy cities, their unpredictable nature could still lead to significant consequences. How dark comets could have delivered water and life-building materials. One of the most compelling theories about dark comets is that they could have played a role in delivering essential volatiles such as water and organic compounds, into the early Earth, contributing to the origins of life. This hypothesis ties into a broader scientific idea that comets, asteroids, and other space objects may have been key to the formation of life on our planet. Research has shown that comets and asteroids likely delivered the building blocks for life, such as amino acids and nucleobases, throughout the early solar system. These compounds may have seeded the formation of life as we know it on Earth. Dark comets, with their potentially more subtle outgassing mechanisms, might have contributed to this process in ways we haven't fully understood yet. For instance, studies of Mars and Titan, one of Saturn's moons, have shown that these planets may have also received vital ingredients for life from comets. By comparing the chemical compositions of materials on these planets with those found in comets, Scientists have suggested that comets may have delivered water and organic compounds to these bodies as well. Real-world connection. NASA's OSIRIS-REx mission, which recently returned samples from the asteroid Bennu, 
is a prime example of how space agencies are investigating the role of space objects in the origins of life. Though Bennu is an asteroid, the mission's findings could provide crucial insights into the kinds of materials that may have been delivered to early Earth through comets and asteroids, further supporting the idea that dark comets could have played a similar role. The Potential Threat of Dark Comets while the discovery of dark comets opens up exciting possibilities for understanding the origins of life, it also raises important questions about potential risks. How likely is it that a dark comet will collide with Earth? While large asteroid impacts grab all the headlines, smaller objects, like dark comets, pose a significant yet often overlooked threat. As mentioned earlier, dark comets that have inner circular orbits are more likely to interact with Earth. Although the risk of a catastrophic collision is low, the unpredictable nature of their orbits and the lack of visibility of their outgassing make it difficult to track their movements accurately. This is why monitoring these objects is critical for planetary defense. Real-World Connection NASA's Planetary Defense Coordination Office PDCO, works to identify and track near-Earth objects NEOs, that might pose a risk to Earth. Their efforts include tracking asteroids, comets, and other small bodies that come close to our planet. While dark comets have yet to be fully integrated into these efforts, they could soon become a focus for these planetary defense programs. The Future of Studying Dark Comets The study of dark comets is still in its early stages, but future technological advancements will make it possible to understand them in greater detail. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its advanced infrared capabilities, is poised to play a significant role in uncovering the secrets of dark comets. Webb will be able to detect faint outgassing from these objects that cannot be seen with traditional telescopes. So, what are dark comets, and what are we doing with them? Dark comets are mysterious, hybrid objects that exhibit comet-like acceleration without the typical tail or coma. They challenge our understanding of space objects, providing exciting new avenues of research that could lead to breakthroughs in both the origins of life and planetary defense. The study of dark comets not only holds the key to understanding the history of our solar system, but also has the potential to inform our future. As technology continues to advance, we will uncover more about these enigmatic objects, perhaps leading to new discoveries that change the way we view space, life, and the universe as a whole. If you found this exploration of dark comets fascinating, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more mind-blowing space discoveries. Check out our other videos and stay tuned for more on the mysteries of the universe.